here we would like to calculate what is the velocity acquired by a metal bob of a simple pendulum when you initially give some velocity to it like this you have thrown the body with certain velocity you are pushing the pendulum with velocity v pendulum cannot completely go away from this point of suspension because it is suspended to a rigid support so what happens is it will shift from this position to this position we would like to calculate what is the velocity acquired by the body at this point if you observe with reference to the point earlier the bob is at the main position itself so it is not having any potential energy but now it has acquired a height h so we can take the law of conservation of energy into consideration between these two points let this is the point a let this is the point b as there is no loss of energy in any formats we would like to say total energy at the point a equal to total energy at the point b total energy means potential energy at the point a as well as kinetic energy at the point a because that is the two formats of mechanical energies total energy at the point b means potential energy at the point b as well as kinetic energy at the point b being this a itself is taken like a reference point potential energy at the point a equal to zero as we have given say for example some velocity v1 kinetic energy at the point a is half m v1 square potential energy at the point b is mg h with reference to that point and kinetic energy at the point b is half m v2 square so we can write half m v2 square as half m v1 square minus mg h anyway being m is common in all of them we can cancel them and we get an equation that v1 square by 2 equal to gh plus v2 square by 2 by multiplying with 2 v1 square equal to 2gh plus v2 square we want to calculate v2 if v1 is given so we, we can write v2 square equal to v1 square minus 2gh therefore we can say v2 equal to square root of v1 square minus 2gh but generally in this kinds of the problems the height value is won't be given rather they will tell you that the pendulum shifts by an angle theta with the vertical